Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another video. Today we're looking at the Covox 4 or CVX 4 from Sedaco. Shout out to Vogons. A lot of the Vogons members were actively involved in shaping the sound and the design of this device. Um, what is the Covox 4? It's basically a clone of the uh, Covox Speech Thing, which was a 8-bit parallel port digital analog converter back in the late 1980s. And uh, the way it works, it uses uh, what's called a resistor ladder, and it was all about the uh, tolerance and the precision of the resistor. So the more precise the resistors, the better the sound quality. And uh, this guy doesn't muck around. He went with 0.1% tolerance resistor, so that's as good as it gets. And we also have some dip switches that let us tune the sound. So dip switch one to five, we can change the filtering. So basically uh, one does the least filtering of high frequencies, five does the highest. Uh, recommended is uh, setting it to two, that's a good compromise. And we also have dip switches six to seven, which is a volume divider. I just uh, leave that on seven to get slightly better volume. Do note that this doesn't have an amplifier, there's only so much current you can draw from the parallel port. So you should, you have to use basically uh, either powered speakers, amplified speakers, or connect this into the lining of an amplifier for example. There's one more dip switch but that doesn't really seem to do much, the DC bypass, so I just leave that off. And to plug in the device, all you need is an older computer with a parallel or LPT port or printer port, what it's called, and you basically just plug it in here. And that's really all you have to do. And then connect your uh, speakers into the headphone port. Now, in terms of pricing, you're looking at 20 euros. That seems a little bit high. However, you have to realize that this really is the highest quality Covox clone project that exists. And it's also customizable, which I haven't really seen on any other products. Let's talk about games. Game support is rather limited. On Moby Games, we've got a list of around 50 games that support the uh, Covox. So I'm going to connect this to a Celeron 266 and we're going to check out some DOS games. A lot of games that do support the Covox are quite unknown or definitely not mainstream and I've never heard of them but there are a few that are quite uh, well known so we're going to have a look at them and I'm going to do a direct capture and record through the line in. So there you go, we had a look at a few games. Now, where I see this device being used mostly is to uh, listen to PC DOS demos. So there are quite a bunch of uh, demos out there that support parallel DAC projects like this. You either select the Covox option or sometimes it says something like DAC or resistor ladder and also listening to tracker music mod files. So that's where I see this being used uh, mostly. So there you have it guys, this is the Covox 4, 20 euros and it's yours. High quality parallel DAC based on the Covox speech thing. And look, it's not a sound card replacement. If your machine has an ISO slot or PCI slot, you're better off using a normal sound card, of course. However, if you are in the market for Covox or you wanna experience it and you just wanna try out a few other options, or you push PC, maybe it's a laptop, simply doesn't have a sound card and there are no other options, then definitely 
this is better than having no sound at all. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave me some comments down below. What do you think about this project? And I see you soon with another video.